Okay, y'all, so this is me right here, and I'm watching, um, uh, Turning Red. Yep, I'm watching Turning Red. So, anyways, y'all, I'm gonna detangle here with my paddle brush, and, um, yeah, y'all, I just, I, it's hard when you got so many people in one house now, so I'm doing my hair in the middle of the living room, y'all, in the middle of the living room, but anyway, so once I detangle it, um, I take that quarter and then I split it in half again, and I'm gonna pin it up here, y'all just watch, y'all just watch, and then, see, I got a pin up, right, then I'm gonna detangle it a little bit more, uh-huh, uh-huh, detangling, 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 yeah, and I'm not tender-headed, so, it might look a little rough to y'all, but it, it, it didn't bother me. And then I'm going to take this blow dryer brush here. This is the Wild Rose, Wild Primrose blow dryer brush. And y'all, this is a real game changer for me. I love this brush. This brush has really cut down on my blow drying time. Now, if I'm doing a silk press, I will not use this blow dryer brush just because it doesn't get like to the roots. But I will use it for like a style that I would like to stretch or if I, you know, if I need a quick blow dry, then I'll bust this out. But I love this. Um, it came with like four different attachments. Um, I got this from a little place called Dirt Cheap. Now, if y'all in the South, y'all know Dirt Cheap. I, this thing is originally like 40 bucks and I got it at Dirt Cheap for like eight fifty. Y'all, no lie, no lie, I got it from Dirt Cheap. But anyway, so I'm just going through my hair. I think I have it on low. I'm pretty sure I have it on low. And I'm just going through, and I'm working it through, working it through. And as y'all can see, honey, we getting a stretch to it. There's little mama in the background. Yeah, this little mama, she asked me something. I don't remember, but she was asking me something, honey. But as y'all can see, I have stretched to it. See? Look at that, look at that. Mm. Look at that. Yes. And that took, what, two minutes, maybe? Y'all. Woo. So then I'm going to do it to this back section here too. And y'all can see like the, y'all see the stretch. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. And that took two minutes, honey. Like, oh my God. But anyways, y'all, I'm going to just, you know, I'm going to just keep doing this. And I do it for my whole head. I think maybe this whole process took me like 20, 20, 25 minutes. I'm not sure. But as y'all can see. And see, now that's the one thing, <laughs> that's the one thing I do not like about this brush is that the bottom is very, um, heavy. And so as you guys can see, I naturally want to hold it where the attachment and the body of the dryer meets. And sometimes the, um, I hold on the two, um, release buttons right there. Y'all should see it here coming up. But sometimes, like, when you're blow-drying, your hand just naturally goes to the narrow part. And I hold, I accidentally press the, um, release button a lot. Well, I wouldn't say a lot, but every once in a while, I'll press it. Like, see, right there, you see the two release buttons? So I pressed it, and then it was coming undone, so I had to put it back together. But, y'all, I, I just love this thing. Like, I've, y'all, my sister came to visit me. And she used it because she was like, do you have a blow dryer? And we had this little small itty bitty Revlon one from way, way back in the day, honey. And it had died. So I brought this and I was like, hey, you can use this one, sis. And she was like, what is this? This ain't going to do that to my hair because my sister is straight 4Z hair. Y'all heard me, right? She is straight 4Z hair, but her hair is not as thick as mine. Oh my gosh, y'all, she used it, and she was like, I love it, where did you get it from? And I was like, you ain't got it dirt cheap, so you can't get it from dirt cheap, but I found it at Walmart for like 40 bucks. That's why I knew it was a steal, honey, I knew it was a steal. But anyways, y'all, I'm just gonna do this, and I think I did have the head. I'm pretty sure I did have the head. Let me look, let me look. But y'all, I'm sorry, just look at my arms. My arms are like really, they are really coming together if you ask me, honey. I know that's not part of the video, but, and those are the teeth on the on the comb. And I'm going to show y'all how much hair I take out. But y'all, my arms are just looking so good. I can't wait to pick up going back to the gym, honey. But look, so this is how much hair I got 
from this section of my head. And mind you, it's been... Oh, yeah, I did do the other side. I did. I did. <laughs> and mind you, it's been just in a poof for a while now. I hadn't brushed it out in like a week. So, yeah. But y'all look. Actually, I did the whole head. Well, goddamn. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I'm doing this voiceover like a week later. And I, honey, yes. Look at that mane. Look at that mane. I was actually, once I, um, I put my hair in that protective style. I was going to get a professional trim. Because as y'all can see, my hair needs it. Like, it needs it. But anyway, y'all, this is what it looks like once it's fully blow-dried, honey. Look at this stretch. Look at that stretch. Yes. That's what I like. That's what I like. Okay, y'all. In this little clip, I'm showing you all the hair I got all together. So, anyway, y'all. So, this is me right here. And I am splitting my hair. Yeah, yeah. Them ends is looking dusty as hell. Good Lord. But anyways. <laughs> so, I did... I did most of my hair, but um, I just wanted y'all to see. This is this is the this, this is it. This is it. This is the game changer. This is what. So I took this cream of nature. This is not my usual. Y'all emotions has went up in price, and I still cannot grab it. The one <sighs> whenever I go to Walmart, I'm just gonna grab it when I see it, honey. Cause every time I try to grab it when I need it, it's not there. But anyway, y'all. So this is a trick. So I roll it on the rod, right? I roll it, roll it roll it uh-huh uh-huh i'm rolling i'm rolling yes i'm looking and then you twist you twist you see that twist honey you twist until you get all the way to the roots and then you're supposed to put the elastic on the tippy top y'all if y'all saw my perm rod fail y'all know sis, sis sis this looks way better way more put together way more tighter than my perm rod fail if y'all know y'all know but y'all this i mm, mm, this might be my new go-to no lie no lie y'all this might be my new go-to and then i'm just twisting uh-huh twisting yeah and then i secure it i secure it uh-huh boom and I think, I think, oh my gosh, let me see if I can remember. So this perm rod that I got off of Amazon, it came with 60 and I want to say I use maybe 50. I didn't use all the perm rods because I had some left. I, hmm. Or maybe 49, maybe I use 49 perm rods. I'm not sure. But yeah, y'all, y'all see that? Look how much smoother and look at the ones I've already done. Look how much smoother and tighter that the perm rod looks on my hair. Like, oh my gosh, y'all, I, mm, mm. y'all see that? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I'm happy. Okay, y'all, so this is what it looks like done. Y'all see how smooth they are? Do y'all see how smooth they are? This is so much better. The roots could be a little bit better had I, you know, used a regular blow dryer to get closer to the roots. But yes, honey, this is so much better. And I had six left, so I used 54 perm rods. Yes, honey. Whew. Hi, y'all. So, I'm just in the next morning. Everything feels dry. Let's hope it's dry. See if I have Dean myself. Well, I think I clean my teeth. Wow. If y'all see my perm rod fail, like, this is so much better. I wanted to do, like, a cute hairstyle for, um, the end of the school year. Since I'm gonna have, like, so many parties and stuff.
give my hair a little more time to be before I put it in projector style. Look at that. Wow. Well, I'm going to take these down because, well, I'm going to take the rest of them down off camera because it's uh, 8.23. So, yeah. And I'm going to catch y'all when I'm separating. Okay, y'all. This is how we're looking. Um, Whenever I do my hair, I like to already pre-part my hair. And so, I, I'm going for a side part. This is the oil I use. And yeah, I'm just, you know, separating my hair. Wherever I feel like the hair naturally wants to separate, that's what I'm doing. But it looks really good. It looks really good. <laughs> Compared to my uh my fail, this looks amazing. This might be my new go to, honey. Yes. And they're so <clears throat> using that IOA I mean that cream of nature. It's so soft. It's so um not dry it feels really moisturized like i love it see it moves i bounced it up but yeah i'm gonna finish and i'm gonna show y'all the end result so this is what's right here I love it. There's no part. <laughs>